everyone. We're back out here at Herman Airport. I've got the FF Bird of Prey. Uh, I'm getting ready to do uh, some more flights with it. One thing I did, I uh, increased the throws on the elevator. Hopefully increased the uh, pitch authority because the last flight, the maiden flight, it seemed like it was a little bit weak on pitch authority. So I turned up the throws on that to hopefully uh, increase the pitch authority. So uh, let's take it up and see how it flies. Um, I'm going to get ready to launch it. Um, the last couple flights, I was launching at full throttle and it seemed like it suffered from quite a bit of torque roll. So I'm going to try and launch it this time at about three quarters throttle, see if it'll uh, do a little bit less on the launch. <laughs> A little bit better there. Much better. Okay guys, I got the HD webcam on the bullet plane. I'm gonna see if we can film Paul's bird of prey. Paul? I guess, yeah. You have to kind of I've got my onboard on. camera on. You want it, Tom? Yeah. You're faster. That's only half throttle, Tim. <laughs> we did clock it at 76 miles an hour, Tim, earlier, last time, with that GPS. <laughs> How many we got up in the air over here? Four? Four planes. in front of you. Oh! <laughs> Get that thumb? Yeah. Yeah, it definitely feels like it flies a little bit better um, with the increased um, elevator throws. It has a bit more pitch authority. You behind me, Franco? Yeah, I'm trying. Here, I'll try and fly slow. Don't fly slow, too slow. Oh, how about that? That's half throttle. Oh man, I went into them trees over there. Oh, wow. Where? Right by the pond. Oh no! It's water. It's water. You get him? No. Oh! All three of them! Yeah, this bird of prey actually flies really well. Um, a lot better than I thought it would originally when I was building it. Oh, <laughs> damn! <laughs> 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 Two stealth aircraft. Yep. 117 in. Oh, three of them. Three of them, actually. Oh, oh. <laughs> How are you going? <laughs> three of them. I was doing a couple of rolls, picking my orientation back out. All right, formation flying. <laughs> flying. <laughs> what I've been trying for this whole time. When you're flying, I'm fine. I'm finishing it off. Okay, try some in, fill my thumb, trying to inverted flight. Someone was asking about an inverted flight of the Boeing Bird of Prey. You got that thumb? Yeah, I got it. Looks like it flies okay. <laughs> yeah. um, That's hot. The initial roll to get it inverted was a little crazy, but... Looks like it flies okay inverted. Roll back over. Okay, we're back to normal. Okay, we've been flying for a little while. I'm going to bring it around and bring it in. Okay, you got it though? Mm -hmm. Tim's trying to kill Tim me. I'm trying to pull I'll never catch it.
Oh, I heard the plane. <laughs> ah, what's Got this? Yeah. Okay, guys, that's it for the bird of prey and the other planes here. <laughs> Yeah, the wind's definitely kicked up. It's probably at least 10 miles an hour. Yeah, it looks like we've got a storm brewing over there. I think that's what's causing all the wind. Let me take it up. That prop sounds so cool yeah. too. Man. You can see a little bit of wing flex in the winds um, when it's flying by. Yeah, it's still only about half throttle. Hey everyone, we're back here at uh, Herman Airport. I'm with Tim from the Bloody Mix. He's got one of the FF22s with a pretty cool uh, tape scheme. He's getting ready to fly it, so uh, let's see how it goes. Oh, real quick, uh, Tim has a setup, um, basically with uh, quad elevons, kind of like some of the other planes that I've been designing recently. Um, he said it handles a little bit different. I assume it'll probably be a lot quicker in the roll. Let's see how it flies. <laughs> Incredibly stable too. Yeah, that's one thing I've always really liked about the uh, FF-22. It's a very stable flying plane. I'll give you a roll. There we go. But what I like is the high alpha. Oh, yeah, that's probably awesome with those. Let me get my throttle to the right spot. There we go. It's actually losing altitude there. Get another notch up. Shoot! <laughs> Sorry, uh, up her pitch. <laughs> what motor do you have on this one, Tim? Oh, that's 2212. So you're just using a basic 2212 yep. six. Six x four prop. Do you know what the weight is of this one? Um, no idea. Okay. I assume it's probably lighter than my original because you built it out of uh, Dollar Tree foam, right? That is correct. Yeah, that's a, about 22 ounces. Yeah, that's a lot lighter than uh, being built out of the Elmer's foam. And this this one should be pretty light too because I've never wrecked it. <laughs> well, and, and you're short a servo. Yeah, and it's only two servos, and it's all hot glue. I didn't epoxy anything, but it is carrying lights in it too. Yeah, I think the very original ones I built are around 27 ounces. Like I said, it was built out of the heavier foam board. So definitely out of the uh, Dollar Tree foam, it's uh, more floaty and uh, Hang on. flies a lot lighter. Whoa, I lost you. <laughs> <laughs> you got to tell me what you're doing, man. <laughs> okay, I'll try that one again. That's what I was telling Frank. I always... figured you'd just run away. Oh. <laughs> it looks small in the camera, so. Oh, well, it got about 10 feet. In front of me? Yeah. That used to be my famous maneuver. Going up! There we go. I got you that time. <laughs> yeah, Frank's famous for that. He don't tell me what he's doing, and I always lose him. <laughs> yeah, John and I do that too. So I tell him, start announcing what you're going to do, so I'm kind of ready for it. <laughs> it takes the fun out of some of them. Yeah. It seems like it has plenty of power even with the uh, 2212 6. Yeah. Since it's a lot lighter. What I don't care for is I'm forgetting to cool my battery down. Yeah. <laughs> I, there's no ventilation on the battery. I need to put like a hole in the hood for this kind of weather. And in the wintertime, it does fine. Yeah. But we're out here, you know, it's 95 degrees and I'm, you know, heavy on the throttle. Not real healthy on the batteries. Okay, guys, yeah, and this is one of the free plans we do have on the website. So if anyone else wants to build a FF22, you can get the plans free at our uh, blog site. I'll put a link in the video notes. Hey, let me try 
try to be stupid. If I can slow it down enough, I'll try to high alpha it here close. Wonky. Oh, too much throttle, I think. Oh! Oh! It went down flat. Maybe right. At least it's in the, yeah. Anyway, nice job on the build, Tim. Thank you. <laughs>